embarking. <laughs> yeah, not my talent, the viewers' talents, <laughs> ah. thankfully. Um, but Saturday night, very exciting night, not yeah. just because of Britain's Got Talent on the telly, obviously, but 221,802 miles away was the moon. That's the closest, closest it'll be all year. Right. So it was a super moon, and this is what it looked like from Burgess Hill, where Eddie Howland managed to find a hole in the clouds at around midnight. Uh, meanwhile, Paul Britton's view from Southampton was equally as impressive. Oh, oh, wow. Although at the New Forest Observatory, there's been a discovery of a new little planet. Look, <laughs> uh, well, not really. Greg Parker, who was trying to do dodge the downpour, did something clever with a fisheye lens, resulting in this, which is a planet based on his house and his garden. He even <laughs> went out into the wide world of the North Weirs of Brockenhurst and took that one as well. It's amazing what you can do, isn't it, when the weather's poor and you probably watch too many energy adverts on the telly. The yeah. weather is always poor. <laughs> just, just at the minute, it is always poor. And, you know, just between us, it's going to get poorer. It is. Yeah. Oh, great. OK. Here, then, with a very, very... <laughs> Poor weather forecast, Simon Porky Parkin.